Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to use .env file inside a Node.js app. Okay, so the .env file is used just to keep the secrets, like to keep your API keys inside that file, and uh, database URL connection and port number and other things that you would like to um, just keep them secret that no one should know about that because if someone else get those things, they can. Uh, uh, access to your site or just uh, means uh, access your website from you so mm, we will just learn now how to use this .env file inside node.js okay so first of all for that we will need to install a package by the name of .env first of all let's look at that package .env okay let's search it uh, i think i'm not connected with the internet connection so let's refresh it let's open this dot env okay in npm.js website so this is that package okay so let's copy this and we will install it inside our node app let's move to the terminal and let's come here and let's let's close this and here i will move cd to the server app it means node app and there i will install that package npm install dot env package has installed so after installing now let's import it inside our uh, server app okay I have already created I will delete this file index.js here first of all we will import dot env package okay let's write const dot env is equal to require from dot env after importing dot env now let's use it in dot env we will call config method okay after calling it now let's create uh, two variables okay let's create first of all um, dot env file dot env after that we will create two variables here first of all is port is equal to um, right now the port number of our server app is 3001 this one let's change it to 8000 okay like this are 8001 like this okay in the database url database url or database connection so the connection is now let's just cut the connection string from this file okay i will cut it and i will assign it to this variable save it now let's use these two variables inside our node app so to use them let's create two variables const port is equal to process dot env dot port okay so it will just get the port and also const url is equal to process dot env dot database url so after assigning these two variables now let's use our url here and the port number let's change the port number from 3001 to port after changing it so now let's move to our front end because we would like to use this port number in our front end there i will change the url okay just come here to the users and here i will change this 3001 to 8001 because i have changed the port number there and after j6 So let's refresh it. Yeah, save it and now let's move and refresh it. Refresh it that is the same. Okay, okay. We got the data again. If we change this 3001 and also in the user, we cannot access because we have changed the port number right now. Save it now. Let's move to let's refresh it. See, we didn't get the data. So it was all about how to use the .env file okay inside node.js okay we have created the .env file and here we will assign all the secrets like API keys and the URLs ports other whatever you want and after that we will use them like this okay first of all install the package then use that 
Okay, call the config method and access the variables. So it was all about that env file inside Node.js. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.